pigtail nail. <laughs> pigtail, cow's penis. <laughs> no legs at all. <laughs> We moved to another hostel and seems like every place, like all the hostel and hotel and everywhere in Arequipa, they provide breakfast. Good breakfast also. It's like the whole pile. And this place, how cute the hell is someone prepared it for us right there. <laughs> It's weird because it tastes like, you know, rice cakes? That's what it tastes like. It tastes like rice cakes and then the yogurt is like really flavorful. I like this pastel a lot. Those Andes, but this is a shame. We are walking out of the Arequipa center. You know it right away. You notice right away that you're already out of the center because everything getting more hectic and then all these buses, cars, pollution. It's still pretty. <laughs> we have the volcano over there. On the way walking, this is so cool. We accidentally just see some of this All this small little alley, they have all this white volcanic stone to use as their brick. We are the Mirador Yanahuara, and we're so lucky. We've been told that we should be here. Seven ish, eight. Right now, it's around like 10. And behind me, right there, volcano. We we'll have to walk around here a little bit and maybe gonna go check out some other stuff. They have a few museums over here and over there they have Adesanya. We're waiting for the Picanteria that we want to come to open because usually Picanteria open for lunch. A lot of them open around 12 so a few hours to queue. Amigo, smile! Good job. Que te lado, que te lado, que se lado. ¿Cuánto es? Hay de tres soles de cuatro y es. Second one. Yesterday we also had, like that was our first one. This second, the sun, totally neat one. There's nothing around here but a little bit of milk, a little bit of coconut, a little bit of sugar, cinnamon. Hmm. We are at another picanteria called La La Nueva La Nueva Palomino. Look how crazy! This is how many people that have been waiting before they open at twelve. It's like a Black Friday. Ooh, that is why. It's actually not the way that they usually do it, but we need some spices. Mm. At first it's more like salty, but then just a little bit after you swallow it, the heat kicks in. It's quite yummy. The chili sauce here in Peru, chili and all those like herbs. Come here, Cuella. Hecho en la casa? Sí. Del maíz negro. We got the whole jug. Oh, it's corn beer, but sweet and sour, kind of very big glass. We have like two big cups over here. Still a lot in there. Mm. 
does taste like cider. Yeah, but not as strong. You can still feel like the natural because this is all like boiled corn, and then for a minute. Some sugar and stuff for like a week. Way back there! That's crazy. Have the whole job over here. With the grandma, with the mother, and all the kids. Now get a little bigger, but still family owned. A lot of stuff here. We happen to order something called Super Picante. The guy recommend us because we want this thing called Rocoto Relleno. Very spicy chili pepper like a red one stuffed with some meat and stuff he recommended this one because it's bigger it's also come with like the dish of the day and some other stuff together and we can share one dish with two people si. Woo, gracias oh yeah this is bueno Whoa. oh crazy oh crazy <laughs> we're like oh we get the main dish should we also get the appetizer too I'm glad we didn't because we're gonna be super stuffed, like dead already eating this whole thing. Oh, oh, mmm, mmm, so good. I didn't ask for more corn. Wow, I don't know what to do now. This is so bad. Wow, this is crazy. You see, that's a piece of really big cheese. Potato with cheese also. A lot of cheese. And that was actually what we came for. Pigfoot! Kevin's favorite. Pigfoot right there. Some meat over there. That. Locro de pecho, which is like the cow bread with spicy garlic and mashed potato. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Ah! Right. Yeah, it's mashed potato. Something in it, chewy. Yeah, this is the good shit. Yeah? Oh, yeah. They love, they love their onions here. We have onion with every meal, seriously. Well, oh, American type. Ours are way stronger than this. Yeah. We'd not be able to do this with ours. Oh, me? Big bite. Mmm. It's like cheesy? But that type of cheese. A little fishy. Mm -hmm. It's quite dry also. It's like a little bit dry. And you see how like all the waitresses and waiters dressed in the picante area. Old school. Oh, three pig feet right here. It's cold. Mmm. I like it. That's why I like all this chicken feet, chicken neck. You like the cartilage? Mmm. It's like. I'll try it. First time ever. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, just like a giant chicken foot. Mmm. Okay. You eat the chicken feet, I'll eat the beef, I'll eat everything else. Pig toenail. <laughs> What's the last thing you stepped on before you did, huh? <laughs> Pig tail. Kyle's penis. <laughs> Who likes it all? <laughs> all the cutlish and all the like chewy stuff. Yum, yum, yummy. That thing. This is so much. How can we like finish it all? <laughs> This is not spicy, no? It's the pepper. Oh, we haven't tried the pepper yet. Rocoto relleno. So, this is like the red pepper stuffed with all the meat and then spices topped with cheese. <laughs> this, they say, the most spicy food in Arequipa or in Peru? Let's see if it's that spicy. It's like a stuffed pepper in America. Not hot yet. Honestly, not that spicy. Like, high chili, the small one, that's way more spicy. It's good though. It's like still have that crunch of the chili, and inside got some meat in it and all the sauce. It's really good. Yum, yum, yummy. Actually, I'm gonna just uh, bite this. Yeah, can I? Can we not make a meal like in the meal every time? 
It's not even that hot though. The inside sauce almost like sweet and sour sauce. Kind of tough. It's like stewed beef, right? Spice it up also. <laughs> Whoa, they have this whole area outside here, inside and also upstairs. That is spacious. And it's cool how they just like fermented everything in the house, like past me. Glad we got here so early. Look at the line, that's crazy. Oh my, outside also. Ah, turn out that big plate. 50 solas and the jug of corn beer the chicha decora supposed to be 15 but somehow they said it's already included so that whole meal was 50 solas for two people yum, yum, yummy i think that was totally worth it with all the service we have with all the music that we walked into at first so big so much food so i like the meal and i like the drink a lot the chili though rocoto was not that spicy. Great meal. I hope you just enjoyed this fun and food vlog. And for now, ciao!